Vibe. Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising. It is second week of September 2017, and the week begins from the 11th until the 17th. Okay, I want to say thank you um, for returning to my channel. Thank you for the wonderful support. Um, please continue to support us and I also want to say that this week is the week where the hurricane um, is going to hit us and uh, I'm in Florida so if there is uh, if you receive no um, readings for the next two weeks or so and that's because of the hurricane okay we are not sure what's going to happen but please um, remember the people who are in the part of the hurricane and who have um, um, the disaster that has happened in other other countries okay all right, I'm gonna make this quick. Um, please like and share these videos. Listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign, okay? And if I should not be able to um, post readings, please listen to the monthly readings, like the next two weeks reading, okay? Because I it's in weeks. All right, for you guys, the energy vibration of this week, as I said, is an Earth week. It's a total positive Earth week. So the 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 earth energy is going to bring balance for uh to you um aquarians okay so this is going to be um wonderful so here we go four of hair you have the energy of rest you need to rest you aquarians have the energy of the four of hair that is coming in to tell you that you need to rest you need to take it you know you need to take it down a notch whatever is happening around you you need to take it down a notch because you need to rest so this is going to be a good balance for you Aquarians in this week because you have the energy of the four of the hair as we are looking forward at your week which and um, what I'm using is the good Tarek from Colette Barrett I love Colette Barrett I think she is wonderful the good talk okay it's new um my channel as just as i said on the 18th of august it was his birthday and my channel got little birthday gifts okay <laughs> yes i give my channel birthday gifts call me crazy no because i have been blessed with a gift of giving you guys these messages and so i can continue to give free readings here okay Let's look at what is happening in the middle and the center of your week. You have the energy, your own energy vibration. So Wednesday is going to be a positive, positive week for you guys. Wednesday, Friday is going to be a wonderful day. Wednesday and Friday, um, call Wednesday and Friday is going to be a positive, positive day. Okay. The energy vibration, um, the number energy, which, you know, it's, it's very strange because this is four, three, uh, two, five, two is going to be your energy vibration of this week. Okay, I see one, two, and four is also here. So we have two and four. Let's see what else is happening. What else is happening for you in this week, you Aquarians? Let's see what else is happening. For you Aquarians in this week as we move forward we're looking at the energy vibration we have the eight of fire the eight of fire is wonderful whatever um, is happening this is a fire energy on Monday the eight of fire is always the eight um, this energy of the eight of fire is coming in to let you know that um, messages a lot of messages will be coming to you it's as if whatever that was blocking all of these messages, uh, um, whatever that was blocking um, these messages from coming through, they're now going to be coming forward. Okay, so whatever the situation was, uh, whatever was what was blocking your advancements, your movement, whatever was blocking um, whatever communication, the, it's going to be lifted. Okay, because obviously there was supposed to be um, positive information coming in and um, something has blocked it it's as if you weren't receiving your posts it's as if your email um, you weren't e receiving your email um, but this is about information that was coming to you and it was blocked and now the energy of the tower came in to clear whatever that was blocking it you know because people can be very devious okay 
and teaching you these uh, these things people can be very devious people can because the last time people were changing other people email uh, email address and changing e people addresses and getting their post okay people can be very devious people um, can be very dishonest so whatever that was happening whatever that was blocking um, whatever information that should be coming through is now being cleansed and move away congratulations as we look at Tuesday we have the energy vibration of call this is a judgment call and this judgment call is the nine of swords and there's a judgment call and it's the nine of swords. whatever is happening is that you have you are worried about something you got information that makes you very worried so whatever is happening on Tuesday this energy vibration is and Tuesday is an emotional time it's Tuesday is um, information that is going to come at you you know information that is going to come at you that is going to make you start worrying but you are air sign and this is what you should do is to change the vibration of the worries in this week okay so whatever is happening try and change your vibration of your worries ask the universal angels to help you with the situation okay because I know a lot of people will be worrying especially people who are in Florida and where the hurricane is going to be it Wednesday is going to be a positive day. Wednesday is the energy of the star. You carry the energy of the star, you Aquarians, and whatever is happening, there is someone who is the king of pentacles who is going to come in and help you. This person see your ability of what you're doing and they're going to be helping you in a positive way. So whatever is happening, whoever comes in your life who is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, open up yourself to them because they are about to open up new doors of opportunities for you. Accept what they are about to give you on Wednesday okay as we look at Thursday as we look at Thursday we have the energy vibration of um, temperance and this is um, have a patient have patient so whatever is happening on Thursday if you're pushing if you apply for a job you didn't get a response or whatever the situation is uh, stop pushing and ask the universe everything come in divine timing so whatever situation that is going to happen you need to understand that you can't push out against the flow you have to understand that everything happens in divine timing so take it easy whatever is coming up here you have the prince of sword whoever this person is uh, um, have temperance with this person because obvious this person is coming with harsh words to you and um, this can be yourself uh, um, bringing ash words to a mother figure in your life or someone who's very positive for you so be aware of this because sometimes people are not in the right um, um, state of mind to, to hear the things that you want to say and you're an Aquarius and you like to do you're very good with your word but yet still you tend to hurt people with what you have to say so if you are a man between the ages of 18 and 35 be aware of what you said to your mom in this week because it's going to have a huge effect on her on Thursday it can be the rest of the week because it depends on who you are you know okay let's go forward on Friday this is a very very good sign whatever is happening if you have a, something in the justice system in the legal system whatever the situation is you're going to be justified this is going to be good you're going to win this situation you are going to win whatever that has done to you injustice and you are protected in this time because you have defensive okay so whatever that was injustice um, whatever injustice that has happened to you you are going to win because the energy of you being justified and whatever injustice is going to be in black balance and you're going to defend yourself you're going to defend yourself in a powerful way your angels and guides are standing with you and you are standing up for the injustice that has been done to you okay for some people it's it, it is also um, you connecting with the spiritual realm to, because the intergalactic angels guiding angels the goddesses are here 
and they are watching over you and protecting you while you go through something that is very injustice something that as um, uh, people have done to you injustice but you're you're protected it's not that you are guarded in a cup no you're protected you are standing there you are the one who put up this barrier and you are protecting yourself from all these negative energies and people around you as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the hangman on Saturday the hangman is an emotional energy but this is good emotional energy because you need to have rest you are trying to revitalize your energy on Saturday so on Saturday is a good day because you are going to find rest and you're going to be revitalizing your energy you also have the Prince of a sword so you have the princess of swords so you have the prince of swords and the princess of swords is happening so you yourself so for the people who are between the ages of 18 and 45 you know you are showing up in this reading so it's going to affect most of you people this um, these people on the on a Thursday and on Saturday okay so something happened on Thursday and this bring you to a place on Saturday that you're, tr you're you're really looking back at what you have done and trying to find the inner light within. Um, being in an angman position is that you need to revitalize your energy, um, your energy vibration, and this is what you're going to be doing. So it's going to affect each and every person between the ages of 18 and 35, whoever you are, and it can affect older people, which I'm not saying older people because I don't think over 45 is old, but, um, 35 to, you know, 65, this is a time that you're going to Saturday. You're going to use Saturday to revitalize your energy vibration. You know, this is very good that sometimes we just take it easy to get back on balance and in track on Sunday you have the energy vibration of debt it's which is transformation in this deck which is good I love this deck I so love this deck um, let me know what you, you think about this deck it's a new deck that just came out um, and the transformation the ace of one so whatsoever that was happening in your life you are of the power this is a new beginning for you because you have the ace of one so that is the end of a, a whatever negative that was happening in your life and a transformation to something positive and you can see the energy of power the ace of one so you have found the power to make a transformation and bring in something better in your life and this is so so positive this is extremely positive ladies and gentlemen this is extremely extremely positive so let's break down the week and look at the week um, because the energy of love is going to be very very positive in this week whatever is happening love is going to be positive um, love with the family um, love with your partnerships um, the women the young people the between the ages of let's say zero to 35 okay is there's going to be an effect on you on Thursday and Saturday the week is a powerful week it's going to be a positive week we love is going to be exciting for you guys love is going to be exciting for you guys whatever situation that is happening love is going to be positive it's going to be very very exciting so this is going to be good this is going to be wonderful because you need to understand that a lot of situations are about to change in your life for business it's not really a week for business so we are just going to take it easy we're trying to empower self a lot of good things are coming in on Wednesday um, is the best business day is going to be on Wednesday because what is happening is that the energy of the star and the king of pentacles the energy of the star and the king of pentacles which most of you are going to have this energy vibration of the star and a lot of earth sign you'll be connecting with a lot of earth sign in business on this day so ladies and gentlemen let's go forward because we are using the energy vibration of uh, the angels of abundance the angels of abundance we're using the energy vibration of the angels of abundance and let's see I'm calling up on the angels of abundance show me the energy vibration for the Aquarians what is the Aquarians going to have words 
of abundance words of abundance and this is wonderful okay you have the ability to instantly manifest abundance by choosing powerful positive words always describe your own and the world come um, the world economic situation in loving and um, optimism terms and that is what you attract for yourself and for others and you know this is it you know this is what I've been trying to teach people and, and, and let people understand whenever you think positive for yourself that is what is going to come in your alignment that is what you align yourself with whenever you expect the the negative things that is what you receive so you have the ability to instant manifest abundancy by choosing powerful positive words okay we should always choose powerful positive words about ourselves always describe your own and the world's economy situation in loving and optimism terms and that is what you attract for yourself and others and this is a very very wonderful this is extremely wonderful okay the next energy that we have we are using the angels of answers I don't know but they keep on coming up a lot of times so it's the angel answers we are going to be working with also and let's see what is the message for the angel answers for the Aquarians for the second week of September and we have remain positive whatever the situation is in your life in this week ladies and gentlemen remain positive positive so again whatever the situation in your life whatever is happening in your life at this rem moment remain positive okay it doesn't matter if the hurricane is coming because the hurricane is coming remain positive the angels are asking you to keep an optimism attitude there is a very positive momentum um, beginning to build towards the creation of your desire you're um, speeding your dreams along by maintaining a cheerful and a confidence demeanor it may seem as though your plans are taking a long time to manifest but very soon you'll be seeing a change don't allow yourself to lose hope when your dreams are so close to come true so this is wonderful and this you know sometimes it is wonderful to understand that you can't give up hope no matter what it is I am saying to each and every one of you namaste and please remember if you receive no readings for the rest of the month maybe the hurricane <laughs> my my light out I don't know um, please remember us in Florida because I'm in Florida at this moment uh, please like and share it these videos and listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. Namaste. Until next time.